What is POS? A POS or point of sale system is a combination of hardware and software that enables your business to process sales more efficiently. The hardware generally includes the POS terminal and a number of devices known as peripherals. Peripherals can include barcode scanners, a receipt printer, and card machine. These all connect to the POS terminal. With a software offering for your business needs both restaurant and retail, it can be installed directly to the computer terminal and accessed online. This allows you to monitor and analyze sales across several locations. Electronic tracking of sales enables you to easily monitor your business performance with a much greater degree of accuracy. At a glance you can see sales and manage your inventory per location. Welcome to the retail version of Kenta's point of sale. While we have light and pro versions, let's go through the system's overall functions. First, we have four main modules. Inventory lists all your items for management. Sales order handles all transactions. Report consists of various report generation including X and Z readings. Settings contain sales configuration as well as import and export data options. Here is our sales interface. It comes with item pictures and billing details. Here is an in-depth look. On the top left is our order list. On the lower left is a breakdown of billing. This includes the terminal number, and inventory location. On the barcode field, we can enter the quantity times the barcode. This will insert the number of items stated. Aside from the barcode, we have a search bar for manually searching items. Multiple payment methods are also available. This includes credit or debit cards, vouchers, and many more. Once a sale has been completed, here's a preview of the receipt to be printed. Other features include discounts that can be applied per individual item or as a whole. The POS can be accessed remotely via VPN anywhere and anytime. For an online demo, please visit our website below with the following username and password. Tutorials are available on our social media accounts. Welcome to the restaurant version of Kenta's point of sale. While we have light and pro versions, let's go through the system's overall functions. First, the home page has six main modules. Food items define food categories, menu items, and tag their necessary ingredients. Inventory lists all items for management. Sales order handles all sales transactions. Report contains various report generation including X and Z readings. Settings contain sales configuration as well as import and export data options. AR order is for recording non-monetary sales such as representation and complimentary dining. These deduct items in the inventory but does not generate an official receipt. Here's the food item interface. The menu is defined based on the categories. When a category is clicked on the left corner, all food items under that category will be displayed on the right. As you add new food items and categories, define their details here. You can showcase your food items with images. You can also state which ingredients are used to match inventory counting. Here's our table layout. The system comes with predefined tables for dine-in and take-out transactions. Easily track customer orders via table management. You can also define your blueprint table layout at a minimal cost. Here's our sales interface. Food items are displayed with images and billing details. The order list is displayed at the upper center. On the upper right, we have the billing details, bill printing options, mode of payments, and inventory alerts. Various discounts can also be applied. If the guest is stated as a senior citizen, the discount is automatically computed and applied. This is a 20% discount with VAT exempt. An automated discount is also applied for persons with disabilities. 
If the guest is a diplomat, the automatic discount is VAT exempt only. Here is a sample of a sale using an RFID card. Once registered in the system, the card can be searched through the customer mode of payment. The sale is deducted on the card's balance and recorded for future reference. The receipt will display additional details regarding the method applied. Here is a preview for the receipt once a sale has been completed. Other features include the following. You can attach a kitchen or a bar printer through a network. You can add additional terminals or tablet. And the POS can be accessed via VPN anytime and anywhere. For an online demo, please visit our website below with the following username and password. Tutorials are available on our social media accounts. Now let's look at the reports feature of the system. A key feature of this system is the capability to generate various reports for after sales. We have the items report which can display top items sold with current quantity on hand. We can generate X reading reports for end of day breakdown summary. Here is a closer look on end of day sales report. This detailed report can be filtered by cashier and terminal. This also provides the option for returns, exchange, and refunded sales. All of these reports can be printed or generated into a PDF report. Here's an example of top items sold by the end of the day. The reports feature also has an option for cash denominations. This helps for tallying sales with cash collected from the cash drawer. Here's an example of a cash count with discrepancies. X and Z readings are both ready and available for print as you select the dates to cover. With the Pro version, we have the full inventory module. Here is a closer look into the many features available. The inventory list comes with the inventory dashboard. This is where we manage our items details. Purchase order keeps track of items ordered from the suppliers. Issuance receipts keep track of items transferred from another branch or store. Count sheet is used for recording physical counts and actual quantity. Supplier information contains the list and details of suppliers entered. Supplier report is used for billing items and consignee reports. Update stock lets the user add or subtract item quantities. This is especially used for updating quantities regarding returned and damaged items. Location lists all branches and stores for tagging where items are stored. Inventory report is used for quick report generation for variances and cost. Here's a quick look on the inventory dashboard. Here we can see the best selling products at a given time. As we add new items, the product information keeps track of purchases and sales, its pricing, barcode, and other details. The inventory location is a quick shortcut to knowing the quantity per location. Since items can be tagged to a supplier, it becomes easier to view their product catalog and place orders. Any adjustments or logs made are recorded in the item's movement history. In purchase order, we can restock our inventory by tracking orders from the supplier. Your quantity on hand is automatically updated as you receive items in the purchase order. Regarding consignment items, here's an example of the billing report generated. The count sheet displays items counted and not yet counted. More details are shown as you count. This includes variances as well as cost. The inventory report can include these variances and total cost of inventory. This report can also be filtered by choosing locations. Back on the settings module, the sales configuration can enable and disable certain features options. Here, we can add the system's user accounts and customer profiles. More importantly, we can import data and export reports using CSV files. 
Here's an example of an existing customer profile for RFID cards. We can see the customer's purchases, favorites, and load balance. On the top left bar, simply click on the Help button to load the Help menu. Finally, some optional add-ons. The GL Windows accounting system can be connected to the POS for generating reports and account receivables to the supplier. Regarding barcode support, you can use a barcode scanner for quicker product entry in various places using the Kintas POS inventory. You can also use any barcode printer for generating barcode stickers. This is a separate software from the Gintas point of sale and is not included in the POS package.